Well, it's my birthday. <laughs> You. Don't be fooled by my little cropped up in my sunnies, it's actually freezing. I'm not very good at dressing appropriately for the weather. We have a busy little day this morning, so I thought I would just start this vlog off en route, let you know what we're up to. Um, but I'm just getting the bus and I'm going to meet Sarah, and today we are going thrifting for her 30th birthday outfit. I'm really out of breath, but yeah, we're going thrifting for her 30th birthday outfit we're going on a girls night out and we want to get her a cute fit we're definitely normally like op shop girlies the cheap options but today we're going to hit up a few more slightly higher end places in melbourne some more sort of vintage shops rather than you know op shops just to try and find something that's a little bit more special it's a very special occasion it's a big deal so yeah, we wanted to make it a bit more of a special experience and find something a little bit more fancy, a little bit more high-end. Very excited, en route to Sarah's now. Then we're gonna get a coffee and we're gonna get cracking. So I'll take you along with us and show you where we go. Stop number one. It's very like swishy. Yeah. Oh yes, the moment. I think it's better doing it in the mirror. It's cute. Like you say, a very good staple. Yeah. There we so go. Simple. It's like what, $65 for Zimmerman leather dress? It's pretty good. Yeah. Okay, good turn up. Yeah. What do you mean? Yeah, but like I say, that's not a lot for a top. Yeah, and it's a, like, it's not just a plain tank. Like it's a cool, yeah. glittery, fun top. That's true. I love that. Oh my God. It's very like, <laughs> in the hips. Yeah. It's kind of fun though, because it makes your waist look yeah, teeny tiny. Yeah. Show me the back, give me a twirl. <gasps> Shake your tail about this girl. It's very um, like sex in the sea. <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of sexy. It's cool. Yeah. You know what? I think it's not so much this that puts me off. It's more the the lace. The lace with like the nude underneath. Pit stop. Pit stop. Coffee break. <sighs> um. This is a separate vlog, so. Oh, he's high. Uh, Sarah's here. <laughs> I haven't seen her yet in this video. Mm. Here I am. So we've been. I did start this vlog when I was on the way to yours. Mm. So they know what's happening. They're aware. They're aware of the situation. But do you want to give them a brief of what you're trying to find? Well, it's my birthday. <laughs> next week. That was giving bad day energy right there. <laughs> Main character moment. It's my birthday next week. So we're trying to find two outfits. Yeah. One of which I think we have yeah. more or less found. I think we smashed it. Um, so I'm going away next weekend with my boyfriend for just the weekend um, for your actual birthday for my actual birthday yeah. and i don't know what's going on i don't know what's happening but i need to find an outfit that's nice yeah how nice we don't know uh, we don't know where, <laughs> where a, boy, it is. a boy says wear something nice and uh, what, what do you mean that could mean anything yeah but so yeah we're, we're taking a, a leap and then i need to find something to wear for our little girls night out yeah. for my birthday which in, is in a few weeks a few weeks yeah yeah which is more Maybe a bit more dressy, but more like night out vibes. Yes. We're thinking, yeah, a little bit more. A bit more pizzazz. A bit more pizzazz. There's not a theme it's or not like a dress a, yes. code, but I do have an image in my mind. Yeah. That's very like dark. We've been saying dark and stormy. Yeah, dark and stormy sexy, is the brief. But like cool, effortless. Yes. Maybe a bit like 90s. Grunge almost. Grunge, but, but hot. hot. Yeah. You get it. Yeah. So that's kind of the brief we're working towards, but we're also open to anything really. Yeah. That, uh, Seeing what we find. tickles our pickle. Yeah. So we just went to Goodbyes, mm. which is Should I show the great. Top? Yeah. I love this top so much. Look at it in the sunlight. Oh, Stop it. Dazzling. So the vision is so this, pretty. With like some tailored kind of low-rise cool pants. Yeah. A really sexy like pointy heel maybe. Yeah. Or boots, whatever. 
and then like hair out, tan. Yeah. My little beautiful pale yellow beaded bag. Yep. Ellen got I got. Me if you bundle. haven't seen, go watch the bundle video. Go watch it. And then maybe like a shimmery eye, maybe like a pale yellow shimmery eye or something. I don't know. That light yellow with a tan. I can't I even. Know. The world's not ready for it. Yeah. I'm but very also excited. like a bit of liner, maybe like a little wing. I don't know. Yeah. I need yeah. to play around. Yes. Yeah, that's where we're at. We're heading next to I think so you know that we're vlogging or anyway, we're heading next to Stupid Vintage, which is I just realized I'm sitting in the shop. You put your booty holes out. It's alright, you can't see. I guess I'll talk to you there because now we're hammering. Bye. <laughs> doubted me yeah again but here I am very thrift mother yeah. with the I think it's with the bun as well yeah let's think about her on the top I love this with the boots yeah like the, skirt, the bottom half is perfect yeah but she's cute give me a twirl the back's very pretty like the open back yeah, I love an open back. Yeah. Oh, I don't think that looks too big at all. I don't know. Is it some seeds? Some views? Excuse my appearance, guys. I am very much in chill mode. I wanted to come on here and just finish off this video and show you the final fits that we thrifted because we were very successful overall in the end. Um, I'm aware that I didn't film as much footage as I had hoped to when we were actually shopping because there was a lots of loud music and good vibes happening in the stores that we went to, which is great, but it means that I'll get copyrighted. So you would have seen a couple of clips from when we were out and um, I wanted to just explain the whole birthday situation. So Sarah mentioned in one of the clips that her partner was taking her away for her birthday weekend. This was all a ruse. <laughs> um, we have been planning for months and months and months to um, organize a surprise weekend away for Sarah, which was a couple of weekends ago, so I could talk about it now. Um, and yeah, essentially the story was that it was just the two of them going away and he just booked like a little wholesome cabin or something. But in fact, we had booked this beautiful like 70s style um, big Airbnb, like this beautiful, beautiful house. And there was a big group of us that were all there to surprise her and we had a really fun weekend away. We went to some wineries. We organized um, a really big dinner on the Saturday night because Sarah's partner's a chef, so he cooked a beautiful dinner for all of us. She ended up wearing a red dress that you will have seen in one of those final clips, and that was from Stupid Vintage. She tried it on and loved it, but it was a little bit more than she wanted to pay, so she was a bit unsure. Um, it also was a tiny bit big for her, but not, I think it looked cool that it was too big. I think it like fitted better that way rather than it being really tight. It just looked like it was very effortless and just like flowed down her. Yeah, so she ended up leaving the dress because she didn't want to spend that much money. But I spoke to her partner about it and he said that she'd mentioned how much she liked it to him. And I just thought it looked so amazing on her. So I went back the next day and bought her that dress as her present, as a birthday present. So she ended up opening that on the weekend away together and she ended up wearing that dress on Saturday night. And it looked so, so good. I also got all the other guests to just wear black and white um, in the hopes that she would wear something that was colorful. And she obviously ended up wearing red. So it was really perfect. She was like, she stood out from the crowd and it looked amazing. So I'll pop in some clips or some photos, whatever I can find online and whatever I can get off Sarah. But that dress is just very like special, special occasion. And I think she will also be able to wear that again for other things. I think you could 
dress it down slightly i think it'd be great as like a um wedding guest dress so yeah hopefully she gets plenty of wear out of that in the future and it looked amazing and then look number two so this was for our girls night out she bought that gorgeous yellow sequiny top which is so so cool and it matched perfectly with a bag that i had thrifted for her in our little thrifted bundle exchange i'll put the link to that video somewhere because that was so fun definitely go and watch that um and yeah i'd wore this bag and it reminded her of the top that she'd seen and she went back and it was still there and it was all just kind of meant to be and it fit her perfectly and so yeah she ended up wearing those two together on the night out with some black just sort of fitted formal pants trousers um and some really cool like chunky silver accessories she had like a silver belt um some hoop earrings some bangles and yeah it just looked amazing again i'll pop in some photos here of the whole outfit together but overall a great success to amazing fully thrifted outfits and we had a really good time it was really fun to try out some more like vintage stores rather than just op shops um obviously they are a bit more curated a bit more expensive a bit more high-end but it just makes a fun change from having to like hunt through all the rubbish to find the good stuff when the good stuff's all like nicely laid out for you so yeah we had a really good time and we're really lucky that there's some great places in melbourne i will pop all the locations that we went to and their instagrams um below so that if you're interested and you are in and around Melbourne, you should go check them out. That is the end of the video, but thank you so, so much for watching. If you are here to the end, I really appreciate it. Please subscribe if you're not already, it would mean a lot to me. Um, leave me a comment with what you thought of the other pieces that Sarah tried on. There were some really cool things that we found. It was really, it was a lot of fun. And yeah, I will see you in the next video.